especially with all... especially with the A League, especially with the yeah. A League, yeah. But at the Central Coast game, there was chanting, there was a tifo, like no one was standing. It was still security, no, not as good. Don't but... no, you've just, you've told an absolute lie. Did you just say that it was chanting at the Central Coast game? I buddy, sorry, I, I don't want to incriminate myself or anyone no. else there. No, I'm That's... saying like a Mariners game had chanting. Get out of town. Oh. No, oh, not, it was a Sydney FC home game there, wasn't it? That's actually, right. Yeah, it was. But Mariners brought some away fans. I swear um, I heard that. I was like on the stream. I was like, I, is that Mariners fans that I can hear? Like, that's outrageous. Like, it's yeah, funny that they come out I of the woodworks now. I from them, but they, they were pretty loud. There was a decent section of them. Oh, that's going to go out for a goal kick. Yes. Yeah, well, that, I, th- I swear I could hear them. Like, I, I, I don't hate the Mariners. Like, don't get me wrong. I don't hate them. But in the same sense, it's just like everyone else where they haven't been around for years and now a lot of their fans are coming out and saying, I've been here. It's like what I say all the time with the Titans. I remember back in 2013, and I think I say this all the time, that I remember one game, there was 2,467 people in the crowd. 2,467 people in the crowd. And the Titans game, I can't remember who it was against. Uh, could have been against the Raiders, the, uh, not the Cowboys. It was against the Raiders or you know some shit kicker team from New South Wales. It just wasn't good at the time too. Uh, so I don't think it was the Raiders. I think it was the New South Wales team. Um, but yeah, there was literally 2,000 people there and I looked around and I said, man, I, remember this right now because one day it's going to be sold out and everyone's going to tell me that they were there with me at that day. I guarantee you, there'll be 10,000 people who tell me that they were there that day at the game where there was 2,000 people there. I'll tell you, I promise you. And you'll be like that with the Bulldogs too. You know, Bulldogs oh, yeah. fans, they're already coming out of the woodworks too. Don't you worry. Oh, here oh, we go. Wanderers here. That... Wanderers. Wanderers. Oh, that's a good ball. That's a great ball. Truissy here inside. Oh, that should have been... That's offside for sure. He's a hundred. <laughs> he's he is three billion percent offside. Anyway, what were you saying? People can't differentiate between like going to every home game and just walking out of the stadium with your head hung low for like a couple of seasons. A and, couple of seasons. Oh, I, a couple. Yeah, I, I went to <laughs> uh, one Saturday game. I arrived fifteen minutes late, sat down the whole game, and left five minutes early. I was here during the bad times. Like, ah oh, man, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like you were there that day when there was only two thousand people there, and I looked, and majority of them were also the away fans. F- FYI. Uh, so you know that that that's the thing, and that's that's what every sport though. But like it's it's very predominant for me in rugby league. I think AFL. Uh, yes, you can see it, but in the same sense, they still get decent crowds regardless. Uh, you know, relatively decent crowds, even if they're pretty shit. Like, there's no real culture anymore in rugby league of attending games. Like, it's because it's better to watch. No, sorry, I feel like it's better to watch. Um, I, well, the reason why people find it better to watch in rugby league on on TV is because it's obviously across a ten meter span. But AFL yeah. being there, it's across a whole bloody field, and you can't really see the whole everyone on there. But with oh, that was nearly nice if they had to kick that ball away. Um, you know, it's just because it's on such a small, defined field in comparison to AFL where you have to be able to watch everything from every different angle. Otherwise, you're not going to see where the play has been kicked to and stuff like that. I, I yeah. get it in the same sense. Like, you know. Well, I, I get that it's better to watch on TV, but, like, I don't go to the games just to watch. Like, I go there for the atmosphere and everything. Is it better to watch enjoy... on TV, though? Like, I don't, I don't believe it is. I think I, with, yeah, like... I think you can, like, you can react to it more if you're just someone who's like, oh, they knocked that on in the rock or whatever. Um, like, you can call for that more on the TV because it's zoomed in on it. It's all focused. Like, you don't need to move your head up and down the field. Like, you can literally just sit there, pizza moving forward and backwards as you eat it. And uh, do nothing. I think fo- the- I think football's pretty good for. I think football's probably best for TV, in my opinion. I think like, football, as in this, as in soccer, I think that's probably it's probably best for TV. Even though, like, it's it's great to be at the game and you can see everything. You don't necessarily you you can basically see a whole half of the field, like at, at all moments, basically. Yeah, but that's what I like, like sitting behind the goal and like you watch your team defend in the first half and then you watch them attack in the. Second oh yeah. Half. You still get some idea. Like, I hate watching like my team blinded. attack in the first half the same way, though. Oh, yeah. I, I like, I, I'm annoyed when people don't immediately boo when our team come to defend <laughs> our end. Like, you know, it's the, the away team coming there just being like, because they're running away from their away fans that travel to the game as well. Like, yeah. You know, they're just being like, Salty, wuss is a bit uh, salty. Not it don't, I just don't understand who would choose to do that. It's like you basically shouldn't even have the choice of which way to go in reality because it's like majority of the time it happens that way regardless because of what you just said. Uh, Brisbane Raw Post says, NRL on TV is great. Yeah, and I believe AFL is way better to watch um, in real life. Well, it is because you can see the whole whole stadium, yeah. Uh, Alfred says, halftime, 1-0, full-time, 1-2 or 2-1. Okay, well, you've just gone with two options there. Uh, and you've, the dice, you've also up. said both teams to win there. You've, you've also given us a, a shout of both teams. You haven't really made too much of a prediction there. 